Hello and welcome back to Dak as we continue with our Northern Dunedain campaign. Still with the janky mouse, but we'll we'll persevere and get through it all. So what happened last time? <coughs> we reclaimed the ragging with a small um, band of our cavalry, which we have now moved joined together with Aragorn. Since I saw this little beauty after I pressed the end turn button, and I thought, you know what? I'll start it here so I don't sound frazzled. So what we're going to do against this army? That's a good question. We can't let it hit Bruinost, or as it's now known as Elendil's Star. We can't let it get to Ossinefiel, so we need to destroy it. And then hopefully also take Anon Enerod in the process. Should be a fun day. Also got more units being moved around, preparing for a counter-attack from Anuminas to possibly take Barketa. And then move into Bari, Donny, Iraq. Because Brielanders is, again, this is not a permanent position for the Brielanders. At least I hope it won't be. Worst case scenario, I'll have to bribe it for, from them with a ma huge amount of cash. Although, again, this is a region we need. It is paramount we claim it in some way or another. Also, we might have break a Fanuzia's um, attack on Anuminas because they glitched out. So yeah, we got really, really, really lucky that they didn't kill us off there. We got super, super lucky. Oh, I, I was frightened at that at that point that we might have just lost a Numenas, but we were fine. We were a-okay. So, let's keep ending the turns. Diplomats are moving. New units are being recruited. I've now got a new general of Infernas Druinen, which we will soon see who he is. Because unfortunately, we can't, I, can't, I can't say who they are because we don't get female generals in this. Quite sad, actually. And my throat's already dying, and I've already drank half a pint of water. Half a pint, half a gallon. Yes. It's a lot, it's a lot, large amount. Oh, Glothendal has come. But he's on his own. He may be strong, but he can't take on an entire army on his own. Because he just died. Did Glothendal really just die? Oh my god. I need to... I need to be sure. He might just be in the trees. Nope, Glorfindel just died. He went in and he died. What was he thinking? Uh, Captain Shakur. You double our numbers. But what is all, all, all of those numbers if it means nothing? If it all means nothing. So not only have they killed Elrond now, they've killed Glorfindel. Can the AI not be? Can the Imlarge's AI not be smarter with their generals, please? I mean, I know everything's getting changed so that the elves are all merged together, but can they just not be? Can they not just be smarter with their their generals, please? They sent in their best general, and just sent him in to die. No, no one's no one's that stupid. The AI should not be that stupid. This is a new one. Um, background art I've never seen before. I don't think it's meant to pixelate Ancalagon because the land underneath is too small. Anyway, let's get to the killing. Scouts to the side, you'll just shoot whatever's in range. Best thing to do with you. Cardolani, you shall walk, move over to here. And of course, we're in a forest battle. But luckily, there's a nice clearing right here. So we shall focus all of our forces into this point. Skirmish mode off. Let's put them in front. And then, Wooden Hunters, Quendi off skirmish mode as well. Put you over to the side. Because your units are more. Expendable. Expendable units expendable unit should always go to the sides, is what I found. Uh Dine, Quendi, Hunters, Cardolani, Guardians, Dunedain Wardens, Lumberman, Aragorn's Great Company in the centre. Protect Guard Dunedain. Oh, even more Cardolani, didn't realise. Thought we just added in more cavalry. 
Oh, I'm both their cavalry over there. Hmm. I think I put my cavalry in the wrong position. And if I could zoom out. None of you hit the wog riders or you hit the wog scouts. You are both in range of the wog riders, just shoot them. Infantry, move forward now. Scouts, I've completely forgotten about you. You deal with those wog riders. They won't they won't ever manage to catch you if you keep in skirmish mode. Huh. They send their general that far ahead. Anyway, let's have let's get dealing with these wogs. Oh no, even more wogs. Those are scouts. Let's do it. let's kill the scouts. Need to surround them. Hold fast. Coming in for the trees. My worst enemy. As you learnt from a, an earlier episode, if you watched it. Early episode, early pa earlier part. I don't know. Hear those wog riders. Dane. Hit those wogs. Mount Knock Hunters. Oh no. No, 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 no. Why are you in combat? You're, you're literally on skirmish mode. You shouldn't be in combat, you fools. If you can trust your cavalry to do one simple job. What are you shooting? I told you to shoot the wog riders. Can you not do your jobs? You three move back. Move you damn fools if you don't want to die. Okay, one and hunters, you're gonna have to be the shields. Someone has to be the shield. Might as well be them. Okay, you should no longer be in this confrontation. You've basically killed the wogs, now you should retreat. Yep, the other casualties were certain, unfortunately. Pushing that far back. Oh, those wog riders that are possibly routing, but I can't tell because they're too far away. Uh, stop shooting at them. Focus on something else in the front line. Or hunters, perhaps. Oh god, this army's getting decimated again. These damn trees are my worst enemy. They always make me lose so many lives. I have to focus on too many places and I can't see everything all at once. How about you stop walking and run? How many times am I going to have to double click my mouse? You can probably hear my double clicks. There we go. Why are you in combat again? Oh, you're not. You're, you're, one the, you're the ones that had to take out skirmish mode because you were being stupid. Okay. I, I politely forgive you. At the same time, scold you. How dare you not follow your orders? So much to focus on. Commentary's fading. Hold the line. 
Men of Honor, Gondor, wherever you are. God, I hate these defense skills. They're so stupid. And I'm doing it in a dying because I didn't focus on these wild runners that were supposedly running away and now came. Oh, I don't know. Oh, this, in this battle, I just don't know what's going on. It's too much to focus on. Look, have you seen how many casualties we've suffered? We might actually be making money after this. <laughs> oh, God. Ugh. This lag. It makes it harder to actually hit things when you're trying to sp you're speeding through everything. Are they running or. Hmm. Weird. They're doing something weird. Yeah, these dinner day needs some um, replenishing. Once we take Anon Enerod and give it over to the elves, hopefully they won't kill off every. Hopefully they won't lose it again. Ugh. Damn it, janky mouse. Ugh. Soon I'll be back to my old mouse, don't worry, guys. I only, I only plan to get two recordings done today because I'm just. Oh, I had to do early morning shopping on a Tuesday. Do you know what that feels like? It's agony is what it feels like. I need to get it done, but it was agony. Okay, they're all running. I don't care if they are or not. I want them all dead. Oh, how many casualties are we going to suffer before this battle is over? There, I don't, it's not a heroic victory. We lost a quarter of the army. Let all who remember this day remember it we lost a solid quarter of our men. That is not a victory. victory. Who took the most casualties? Dunedain Wardens, but they healed... Oh, that's not good. That's not good. We keep suffering too much. I think that's meant to be Don Amroth. Just... Just a theory, seeing it say, um, so reading with swans, it doesn't look elven in any way. There's slightly unfinished ruse. What is that? What is that? My, the ring is now currently over. Also, fisherman of Gondor, because you can tell by the blonde hair and raggedy clothes, the leg braces. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just making pet fairies. Oh, my hands are in pain. I want to get one half an hour video done for this one, part nine. And then for the next part, part ten, I plan to go for an hour long. And then I'm going to have my dinner because I am exhausted. I think I've already said I'm exhausted. Have I said I'm exhausted? Yeah, I did. They've just got a giant army, and Imlarus doesn't even give a damn. We're always the ones that are doing all the work for them. Do we just fight them all together? I mean, Shagbog isn't coming in for a while, because of how far away he has to go. Look what we have left. We lost a unit of scouts. We lost a unit of Cardellani. No, we didn't. We lost still have both of them, but they're very gravely wounded. All of our Dunedain are quite heavily um, experienced, but the ones that aren't are still quite weak. Our wounds have been brought down to near nothing. Oh, God. At least we're equal on numbers here. At least we are equal on numbers. And hopefully, once we kill both of them, I've still got... An, I've, may, may still have a little bit of movement left so I can take Anon Enerod. Because I sure as hell don't want to have to, to wait and besiege it. That's the last thing I want to do. But to say, losing 400 men, slash elves, I don't, I don't think we lost any elves. Uh, why do you, must you always curse me with these trees? I can't wait till, till we start going up north where it's nothing but mountain. Oh, sorry, sniffly nose. 
I think I was a bit audible. You might have heard that. I do apologise. Yeah, th those wooden hunters are all the dead. But to be fair, we, we, we spam them out too easily. We do. We, 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 we are to spam them out far too easily for this entire campaign currently. And that's a bit dis disappointing. Yeah, these units are not worth shooting. Don't shoot them. These units are just worth getting mopped up by cavalry. Because they're nothing but snog and a weak taskmaster unit. Charge down the Snogger. Run away again. Ugh. You, can, you can tell compared to um, last video that my um, skills have dulled a bit since last time. That's because, again, yesterday I was quite full of energy, as you can tell, because I was monologuing a lot. But now, oh, blimey, I'm, I'm exhausted. I say, I say, I'm exhausted. position for those orcs over there. Maybe not where we've not got the hill advantage. Is it dead yet? Nope, there's still some around. Kill them. Kill them all. I sounded more um, Eastern, didn't it? More Haradric. I might try that one day if I ever do a Haradrim campaign. <laughs> oh. oh no, they're not shooting. You should be shooting. I don't care who you kill, just kill them all. Alright, get out of skirmish mode, Elven uh, Bo Quendi. Try to keep them slow by shooting them down. I guess that didn't work. Hit those Snaga archers. No, don't hit the Snaga. Hit the general, the orc bodyguards. Card Lonnie will be long gone before they get. I said long gone. Oh my goodness. Their reaction times are horrible. Oh no, this. They crossed through the Dunedain. Oh, but they're dead now. All the all the Duna, eh, the Dunedain never defended them. That's why I hate seeing the Duna, Dunedain. From now on, I'm just gonna say Rangers and Wardens. The Wardens didn't hold fast against or to protect the Rangers. Oh my, r riders are complete. What the hell just happened? Oh, the Goblin Band. Mm, yeah, all of my infantry just got squashed into one formation in one place. I was so, uh, so poorly done, so so poorly executed. Not over till the general's dead. Not over until the general's dead. There we go. Oh! I always thought they were just um, green circles under them, but no, it's um, it's the insignia on the ring. Oh, that's a nice touch. <laughs> I've been playing this game for nearly three years. 
played for over a thousand hours, maybe even fifteen hundred hours now since I've, since I started doing YouTube, um, on with Dak, and I've only just realised the stuff. It, it may be new, granted, it may be new, but if it wasn't, I haven't noticed the little green stuff, the little indicator that you're selecting a unit was actually the insignia for the ring. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. You learn something new every day, don't you? You learn something new every day. I know I did. Along with, if you're going, if you're going to go shopping, bring more than one bag. It will save your hands a great deal of pain. There we go, the army, the army defending and, and a rod, and the side of it are dead. Oh, when I'm just out of range. You can't be serious. That's the same crap that happened with um, with the with the dwarves last time when I was attacking Dane's Halls. Unlike then, I won't attack it now, because that means Eladon can take it. It means the AI can take it. Oh, hello, Beleg. You're going to be controlling the army that will be going over to Anuminas. So we can fight off against the Angrim once and for all. Oh, hell no. What did they, what did they do? They just doubled their arsenal. Literally. And I have to abandon our soul's defences. Kardalani. Move to a Numinas. You can all sit into our soul for a while. How long are we losing? About 1500 for a while. Yeah. Nope, 2000. We're losing 2000 for a while. Ah, I was not expecting that. I'll end the turn one more time, see what happens, and then we'll call it an end to this part because. Oh, no. I'm not ready for an hour recording yet. I need to get need to get something to eat so I can stay fully in control of my senses so I know what's going on. Oh. <laughs> I wasn't ready for this morning. Oh. But yeah, getting to 10 parts already is pretty good. Getting seven videos just slapped out over and over and over again over two days isn't bad. Although, I granted, I might do some Edine videos later on in the day. However, I will say they will be um, silent because I don't have my mics. Because I've tried to set up my mic in my other in the in the no, on my other computer, but um, I find it better to have it here. I'm just going to buy another one. Okay, this is this has left me even more breath um, confused. Minas Morgul's has been liberated. And they didn't take an on an Enerod. You cowards. Where'd you come from? Oh, you were already there. Firstly, I'm moving out of this damn forest. Second, I'm besieging an on Enerod. Thirdly, I'm losing quite a bit of money, which is expected. Your orders, my lord. Uh Okay, take these units as well. No, I can't move you yet. Oh well. Uh, now I'm gonna turn one more time. I'm feeling generous. I am feeling generous. Oh, Afanuzia is moving up to Barketa. I think gonna be. I think he's gonna become a great rival of mine. Come on, Captain. You just need to keep going through the Breland territory. You're almost there. Just keep moving. Don't look back. Don't stop. We need you to defend the Numenas at all costs. And Bri, I need you to do your duty. Otherwise, we will both fall. Oh, that's a pain in the ass. 
literally. Uh, oh. Best thing is, not much infantry, so that is actually a good thing. We'll fight this next time. I hope you've all enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time. Ta-ta for now.